How's it going guys? Giving here's a VM view on how Gobblegum works in Black Ops 3. So last week we got a little bit more information on how Gobblegum actually works and how it's connected to the level up progression system in Black Ops 3 Zombies. And so I thought it'd be a pretty good idea to do a video on that, mainly because I don't have any other videos to do. I'm, I'm so uncreative, but uh, let's get into this video. So the XP progression system is connected to Gobblegum. And so whenever you play Black Ops 3 Zombies, you're going to be gaining XP. And then when you level up, you'll unlock either a new Gobblegum or a new weapon build kit. And so the weapon build kits will be used to modify your weapons. And then with the Gobblegum, you'll be able to put it into your pack before the match and then be able to like customize which one you're going to be bringing into the game. And so if you guys aren't familiar with what Gobblegum actually does, basically it's like a small perk, you know, like it has a small ability that you guys can use at any time in the game and an example of this is the clone effect from one of the gobble gums basically one of the gobble gum will make three clones of you and send those out to distract the zombies this would be very good for playing with terrible players because if you're playing with your friends and you know they suck you probably want to be using this because this could then distract the zombies and then have you revive your teammate. Now surprisingly right now we don't know exactly how to use your gobble gum in the game and we really don't know what the factor of your pack of gum actually has on you know the gums you can actually access because we do have a gobble gum machine in the game but we don't know if your pack of gum will actually you know limit the amount of gums you can actually get out of this machine and sort of act like directions or this will just be the starting gum you actually have at the beginning of the game and then you can end up with different ones at the end or we don't really know for sure you know no one's really explained this to us we don't know how to use the gum in the first place we don't know where it comes from and we really don't know exactly what the factor of the gum pack is you know i feel like it may be one of those things where this is the gum you're going to be starting out with but can we get more and you know how is this going to work I, we don't know but what we do know is the main point of these new gumballs is to incorporate a new level of strategy into zombies because there's going to be 40 different gumballs I, I think you guys need to realize that there's going to be a ton of change with these gumballs you know think about 40 different abilities that's a lot of things to think about it there's a lot of different ways you can actually take this there's a lot of different gumball builds you'll be able to use when you're playing map especially when you're playing solo and you want to go for the highest rounds ever you may want to do a specific different gumball build where you know when you're playing with your friends that may suck or may be really good you may want to do a completely different gumball build and especially for each different map there may be different things in the easter egg you may want to do and other things you may want to do and so that is the main reason for these new gumballs is just to add a new level of strategy into the game and the last thing we know for sure that's pretty important is that the gumballs will be in both the giant map as well as the shadow of evil maps and so what we do know for sure is that these are going to be showing up everywhere and these will be very important otherwise i'll see you guys next time give and get me out have a nice day 